Banks are tightening credit conditions, but credit conditions remain extremely, extremely uh, accommodative and certainly very, very, uh, very solid. There is very little, uh, at least in the latest data information, that shows that we are seeing a significant credit crunch. Why? Because interest rates remain negative in real terms. Second, because central banks continue to be accommodative also in terms of liquidity injections. So all of that is helping the uh, banking sector is better equipped and better capitalized than in the 2008 crisis, but we cannot just think about this as nothing is going to happen because the risk of uh, reducing core capital remains and the increase in non-performing loans is likely to be evident in 2023 and 2024. Those may not be as aggressive as those of 2008, but we need to pay attention to what is happening in the uh, banking sector and the financial sector so that we monitor the risk of a tightening of credit conditions that may lead to a credit crisis which is not evident at the moment, but with uh, the path of rate hikes and the weakening of global economies added to the reduction in valuations and the price cuts that we see in some of assets of the assets in the balance sheet of banks, all of those can generate some level of risk. We need to monitor that environment. It is not evident now, but the risk is there.